The LA County Board of Supervisors voted today to review the safety of bike paths, walking trails, and promenades after last week's deadly attack in New York City. As Aton Wallace reports, one local company is working to protect pedestrians. They become an all too familiar sight around the world. Nice, France, London, England, and just last week, New York City. Innocent people killed when a driver plowed into pedestrians. But a Los Angeles-based company is hoping to prevent such attacks in the future. Cal Pipe Industries builds these barriers called bollards. The bollards can protect against accidental or intentional vehicular incursions into um, people or property, so into pedestrian areas. Last year, the bollard successfully stopped a car in its tracks before it could hit people in Times Square. The company also installed these barriers along the Santa Monica Pier. They can stop a 15,000 pound vehicle traveling at 50 miles an hour. As you can see here, building bollards is quite a process. Some take up to three months to build and could cost up to $15,000. But Calpipe says it's all worth it because at the end of the day, these save lives. A month to three months for bollards to get made to be able to potentially save a life if there were ever to be an accident or God forbid uh, an intentional vehicle attack, uh, I think is something well worth it. It's crazy. Every day, mother Jennifer Toledo walks her four-year-old daughter, Abigail, to daycare through Expo Park. She says it's important to be alert. Be careful, be safe, and look around your surroundings because anything might happen you don't know and you might not be prepared. It's kind of scary to think that, but it is. It's reality right now. Calpipes plans to install more of these barriers in downtown LA as well as other big cities across the country. For Annenberg Media in Rancho Dominguez, I'm Aton Wallace.